the best thing about Inclusive U being here at Syracuse University is the opportunity that it gives our students to be integrated with the university as a whole. Students who are coming through Inclusive U really are coming through University College as non matriculated students, so they have all the same opportunities that any other student on campus has. My favorite thing about Syracuse University is I love the new program Inclusive U. It is a lot of fun. It's fun, it's cool, I want to do more things here. Uh, when our students are on campus, they, they truly get involved with the campus on, on all levels. It's not just academics. It's a really open, good community. There's a lot of things you can do on campus. I've been on campus for two years now. It's been a great opportunity. A lot of different courses students have taken up here, uh, ranging from religion and sociology, psychology, again, to the different sports-related ones. Well, some of the classes I've taken is 195, which is the intro to IST, which is a very good class. Networking classes, web design, which was a very good class, did pretty well in that. I've had two students from Inclusive U that have taken the class. Both were engaged throughout the entire semester in different ways. In a class of, of over 200, you, you end up with a lot of students who are afraid or embarrassed. And these guys were just the opposite. It didn't matter to them that there were 200 students in there. They wanted to share their experiences. They wanted to ask questions. And you know what? I think they were doing what a lot of students wish they could do. The reception here has been really, really positive. And we just opened the door and allowed the students to be who they were. We're really thrilled at the Tayshaw Center to have Inclusive U be a model program for other universities across the United States, especially looking at ways that universities can implement a fully inclusive model and not have separate and special programs for students with disabilities. Well, the peer-to-peer -peer program is, in my opinion, um, the coming together of students, both with and without disabilities, for everyone to have the same opportunities to experience advantages that college offers. Our most recent peer-to-peer -peer activity was the High Brokes course up at South Campus. We went with the Department of Recreation Services, and we had about 12 students, matriculated and non-matriculated, doing the high elements. And it was a great opportunity for students to push themselves, stretch themselves, and encourage each other to try new things. I am coordinating the Project Search program here at Syracuse University. The students for Inclusive U will come to me and they will complete three internships on campus. Anything that you would do on your job site that just comes naturally, we work on with the students. Interview skills, dress, transportation to work, communicating with their co-workers. When they leave here, they are professional, they are able to get to work independently, be on time, and find employment in our community much easier than if they did not do a job readiness program. One of the Interns. Her internship was in the art department at the bookstore. I'm Larissa. I work here at the university bookstore right here in the Shine Student Center. Basically, they came downstairs and said I was going to get a brand new intern. I just put her to work. Brand new pair of hands for me. My paper pirate, the water pirate thing. Well, I mean, I still have tags on here. <laughs> Krista. She brought what every kid brings. They bring massive personality and someone brand new to work with. One of the things I really love about SU is the diversity. You literally have people from all around the world, people of all different ages, and now we've added people of all different ability levels, and all of it comes together to make a much greater whole. I've seen our students grow and they form a sense of their own identity. Which has been nice, I mean, to really see someone who it's kind of withdrawn and shy to become a person who's more independent and are speaking for themselves, become an advocate. Is walking around with a smile and loves being up here and is fitted in and become a part of the community. And that's a testament to the university as well as the testament to why higher education should be inclusive of all kinds of people who want to learn. Please so far.